excited that we have today's speaker. I don't, um, you know, they get such a short time to speak, so I don't really do much by the way of setup, but I think the setup uh, speaks for itself. And I can say that uh, without stealing too much thunder, he's been um, recognized internationally for his work, so please welcome Hamilton Perkins. Appreciate the opportunity to come and speak to you all. And ah, sorry about that. I forgot my one, my one main. Okay. <laughs> I'm just gonna blow through this. This is gonna be a conversation. Um, you know, I'm Hamilton Perkins, the founder and owner of Hamilton Perkins Collection. We are based here in Virginia. We make fashion accessories, uh, leather goods, and we're made in the U.S. Uh, what we do differently is. I basically started with a personal need. I wasn't able to find enough quality at the entry level uh, of accessories. And at the highest end, I really was you know, disappointed at how expensive everything was and in order to achieve that quality. And, you know, before I started uh, doing more research, I found out a lot of that was really being paid towards marketing and uh, you know, overhead costs. And you know, my, my goal was to put a brand together that would uh, essentially um, cut out those costs and go direct to the customer with a uh, fair uh, markup. So, you know, briefly, we've been in uh, these publications, including British Vogue, Harper's Bazaar UK, Virginia Pilot. I'm an Old Dominion and a Women Mary alum, and both business schools have uh, recognized me for uh, sort of innovation and fashion. Um, we have a new season now that we are expanding uh, as a result of our uh, customers and just talking with more prospective customers, we found that there was a way for us to include them in our community and actually you know, be a part of our design process. And the design process by and large has been very much the same for the last 200 years. So what we essentially have done is crowdsource the design of our new season. This is a product from the line, it's called Zero to 1000. It takes about um, a thousand ideas, roughly, to put this season together. And this first piece right here was about 150 ideas, all in total. And it's made out of recycled plastic bottles. The inside is lined with billboard material. You know, and these are some quick stats on what the collection will achieve. Uh, at a minimum of a thousand products sold. We removed 16,000 plastic bottles from landfills. Um, about 2,000 pounds of CO2 emission are reduced and about 285,000 gallons of water are conserved, so roughly 1,400 families can live on that water for the same year. And we're sourcing all of this in the developing world. Um, our first stop is Haiti, and that's about $300 in direct revenue uh, in the community there. A little bit about our customers. We found that they are riding Uber, they're using Airbnb, and they're super healthy, so we just want to be at the center of that uh, activity in the next 30 years. We've kind of looked at that as a way to engage differently. High level about the fashion industry. Uh, if you look in the store today, you'll see the quality is definitely going down rapidly. The consumer has more power in the end, and most brands are kind of less transparent about their process and how they produce. Customer evolution, we think that in the future, labels will be less relevant. Um, relationship and connection to companies will become uh, more exciting, and you know, e-commerce is going to continue to boom. We're serving millennials with this new collection. We look at this as a $1.5 trillion industry between now and 2020. We're developing personalized connections and we're trying to really be a, at the heart of the hyper-connected millennial. Um, we're using the internet um, and media outlets as our marketing. We're really you know, allowing our customers to do a lot of that work for us and you know, we work and collaborate together. We're doing pop-up storefronts and lectures and showroom. Uh, that's how we kind of get our word out. Briefly, this is a revenue model for zero to 1,000, assuming 1,000 products were sold and how this can hypothetically grow over a three-year period. Lifetime value of a customer is about 10,500 over 360 months. Thanks for your time.